Hey there guys, gales, fans, and pals, your buddy John Megacycle here. Uh, another episode of Autonauts vs. Pirate Bots coming at you. Oh! <laughs> it caught me off guard. <clears throat> That's a delicious way to start an episode. I'll be filthy. Money. Uh, money is kind of one of the things I wanted to work on this episode. Um, we're still cranking out some more bots. I think I ordered tw Hello? Man, hitting tab is a... Uh... Risky Bweezness. Risky Bweezness. Um, that's all still being built out. That's more walls. We expanded this corridor area so I could have more room for metallurgics. As I like to call it. Um, how is... Is metal much, much faster now that we've upgraded all the stuff? No. Man, it still kind of feels like that takes a while. I thought in the other game... What is this? Metal ore... Metal ore deposits. Trace metal ore... Oh! Hold on. Did I... Am I doing this way, way wrong? Hit with a pick to release metal ore. No, I don't think so. I thought there was a way for us to uncover... Better metal. Maybe I'm remembering this hecka hecka wrong. Uh, that other area looked like it was much more appetizing for metal to be a thing. I chucked a shovel somewhere, didn't I? There's an axe. An axe is not gonna help. I want to experiment with something real quick. Metal ore deposits, trace metal deposits. Yeah, I should have I should have set up here. This was kind of not the best spot. Oh! Are they digging into it now? What's going on? Hey, they did! Okay, cool. So that's trace metal. So they all weren't using metal picks. Now yeah, now that kind of solved all the problems. Uh you need to use a metal pick to break through the trace. Got it. Okay, let's take another gander at this. I kind of expect this to be just opening up pretty soon. Let's see, how long does it take for you to mine for metal now? Much faster. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah! That's much faster. Okay, cool. That solved all my questions. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Okay, uh, we're still making bots. We're not making bots. Uh, I can do five more archers, probably. Uh, huh. I want to try something. I want to incorporate sledgy bots into the same battalion as regular soldiers. And I'm going to give them the same order of, you can attack robots or you can attack structures. Yeah, they already have that order. What I'm hoping is going to happen is they will emphasize based on their class. Meaning the soldiers will first attack pirate bots and then attack structures. And the sledgies will attack structures and then pirate bots. We're going to have to see. I'm curious to see how this will work. This next bit of fighting isn't necessarily difficult, but I am the curious. I am the curious. Uh, if I lose the squad, I lose the squad. Uh, that being said, how many guys we got here? Ten? Awesome. I would like ten of these... Um... I want to change this a little bit. Can you do one of them? And then what I want you to do is I want you to pick them up and put them down here like we did the other thing. Like the other bot is doing. Thank you. Pick up. 
bot idol in... Oh! Uh, that's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. Uh, then we need to put him right there. Thanks, guy. We have an attack coming, so just wheel on this thing for a bit. Um, I don't want to start an attack that's going to trigger in like three, yeah, three minutes anyway. Cool. That makes that a lot easier. So then when I come over and I ask for knights, it's a done deal. Did that guy walk out with a full boat? Hey, full boat and some. Way better than before when it was dude with quarter boat. And that was it. Oh, this is going to help really nicely with our additional... Uh, what am I thinking of? Our additional... Nope, I lost it. More bits of eight, I guess I was trying to say. Okay, how is our metal coming along? We're purging it very quickly into crude metal. Awesome. Awesome to the max. Okay, I need rivets. And I would like stone-shaped blocks. That would be pretty cool. Uh, let's see if we could do the upgrade. Oh, no, I can't. I can't do the upgrade because I don't have... Metallurgy or whatever the next thing is. Hold on. Uh, how do I figure that out? Metalworks, that's it. Okay, uh, what I wouldn't mind to figure out is how to upgrade... Stack up to three pallets. I can't build the thing normally. And one pallet doesn't do. I thought there was a way to do this and I don't remember how it worked. Uh, but effectively, what I wanted to do is I wanted to accomplish this. Big pallet. I don't have wood beams, but I would like to at least see how it works. Upgraded from pallet. You're not going to believe this, mate, but I has... I has pallet. <laughs> Alright, I'm not super worried about it. We'll figure that out eventually. That was Stone Miner. Uh, I might want to double this up again. Check that I do want to double this up again. Um, then I would like to talk to you. Hit me, please. Nope, that was the wrong storage. Oh my goodness, could you imagine? Getting nothing done ever forever? Um, log cutter. Storage attack imminent, alright. And since y'all are probably already hecka engaged, I gotta shut you off and turn you back on. Okay, I need another collector. I need another metal collector. Uh, let's see. I think I have such a thing. Metal miner, metal plate maker, metal raw hall? No. Uh, 
Uh, this fight will not last very long. And for your efforts, get your stomp on. Just have some fun with it. Uh, they got two... Two fancy thingies, three fancy thingies. Nope, put them down. Okay, our smoochy kissy guys here, awesome. Uh yeah, do that. Yeah, I need that stuff removed as soon as it's generated. Okay, cool. Little changes like that are really gonna help with the efficiency of our system, even though I don't really want to add a whole nother metal collection system, that works out pretty well. All right, uh, please stop moving. Thank you. Who's doing, uh, why is, uh, oh, there are no more bots, okay. Oh, I see why this was important inside the loop. Uh, yeah, some knights. Ten of them. Well, thanks. Have fun. Are we doing an excess bread? Yeah, okay, we're, we're doing pretty well now. I think. Yeah. Meh, she, meh. Okay, that's all that. This is all probably fixing pegs. Which we're out of. Uh, huh. We're out of pulls? We're not we're not at all out of pulls, so I screwed something up with all this thing. Oh, holy crap. Uh fixing peg make. Peg peg make maybe? No. Yeah, fixing peg make. The hell are you guys? Mechanical frame saw. Take, take, add, add, find nearest. Yep. Maybe I just need to reboot you both. My nearest... My nearest... My nearest... Let's just get these all cleaned up. Move to peg storage 4, add, 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 add. Okay, let's try that again. Uh, fixing... You know what most likely happened is you guys were already... holding something and I stopped it. So, come here, uh, to me, drop, start over. I bet you money that's, that's what happened. My backpack is gigantic. Ha! <laughs> Fear me? Okay, that jump started that. Oh, and we just ran out of all of our money. Nice. Uh, you guys are actually reinforcements. Whenever I want to do the attack, which is soonish, uh, you guys are going to be reinforcements. Upgraded from a small silo. I don't think I know how to do that. 26? Hey! 
we're actually getting ahead of it. That's awesome. I that would justify a third runner. Uh, how are we on? Yeah, we're out already. I think I need to justify a third runner. Uh, yep. So let's see here. Uh, do I have Metal Hall as a... I do. Okay, cool. Thanks. Wow, that's pretty dumb. Like, dumb is in incredible. And two pulls... Metal Raw Hall. I have four dudes doing this? Really? That doesn't sound correct. Maybe that is. One, two. Hold on. Three, four. Oh my god. Okay. We don't have two dudes doing this. We have four dudes doing this. Okay. Uh, yeah, alright. I remember now. Now we've got five dudes doing this. <laughs> That'll keep us pretty flush, I think, with materials, for sure. That's still full. Watery Porridge is still kind of on the sad side. We did just burn through 10,000 monies, though, so that's a thing. Actually, how many are here? Uh, actually, 12,000 monies. I lied. Okay, um... I want to do this thing. Thank goodness we took all the time and consideration and cleared all the mines out last time, yeah? Um, right there, please. K, thanks. And then we do this. Stop and start. Put the flag away. Come on over. Uh, cleaned it up pretty good, yeah. Uh, nothing really here screams like a resource I give a shoot about. Right, it's all stone and cereal. But I want to try something a little on the lazy side. You guys are going after the repair station immediately. Interesting choice. Not one I would have made, but interesting choice. We have the sledgies in here, don't we? We should. Yes, we do. Okay. There's no barracks here, so every bit of damage we do is top, top scotch. Top notch. Uh, so there's some consistency. Uh, it feels a little too ad hoc for that to be remotely decent of like a, a proper strategy, right? Because the sledgies aren't going after the buildings. They're going after the mobs. Ish? Okay. So here's the problem. There's a ton of running around time that feels genuinely like wasted uh, wasted energy. We started up here, then we came down, and then we went to the left, and then we came down again, and now we're back up here. And now we're hopefully going to concentrate on this crow's nest. We're going to go to a different crow's nest. I mean, this isn't terrible. Depending on how lazy I want to be about it, this would work, but this is not what I would call efficient warfare. But 
Go kick down the door. Sledgies? Sledgy boys? Sled Sledgemen? No? Okay, I mean, you're going after another structure. That's cool. So now what's going to happen? Are they just going to attack random crap, or are they going to actually go for these guys? Are you going to go around for the door? Uh, that would technically let you in. Sure. Yeah, uh, no real objection. Sure. Alright, it's multiple layers or whatever. Okay, now get in there and whoop them. If you guys could aggro on me so my guys could come and kick your butts, that'd be great. Oh my god. Yeah, just ice this fool. Thank you. Holy crap. Okay. That was whatever that was. And now we do a stop start. Because y'all are probably really crazy fascinated with whatever's going on in there. Good dough? I have crude, crude dough would be cool to have. And I can't steal out of this, right? Ah, boo. What? What's happening? Oh, you probably ran over a landmine. Okay. Good stuff. And by good stuff, I mean a big waste of manpower, but whatever. Okay, get to it. It's only a little airborne. It's still good. It's still good. Uh, crude dough. Yep, that's what I was bringing. If I could find, like, bread already, I really wish I could steal then. Because that would be a lot of time and energy and effort that I just wouldn't have to do that would be just free money. Dropped it off? Cool. What are you beating up? Oh! We had some guys actually make it there. Nice. Yeah, I would not have called my troops fast at any stretch of the imagination. Okay, I'm gonna just... Uh, or do... That. I'm gonna go get some preemptive smoochy snacks or whatever. One, two, three, four, and one in my hands. Perfect. Uh, I meant to repair this thing anyway, so this works out in the end. Go get them, nerds! Uh, change your mind, or... Kind of. They got routed, and then they're like, you know what, I remembered I don't like that wood tower that greeted us so ineffectually. When we entered this joint, Good stuff, lads. Good stuff. Alright. Over there, please. Okay, thanks. Um, I could use more troops. Uh, what are you waiting on? Find nearest bot. We don't have any more bots. 
How did they miscount that? Again. I miscounted it twice now. Uh, regular bots. I need... 13 would be 45. Thank you. Um, okay. Money? Money not as much of an issue right now. Um, what do we do? A couple things. Could scan around and see what we see and hopefully find the metallurgic things so I can get the upgrades to upgrade the crap I want, like the piggy bank, right? What's that looking for? I was looking at metal. Okay, 88, that's good. Uh, so we could scan around and do some of that, or I could start redoing some of the base. Man, eh, uh, I'm kinda, I'm kinda not really feeling that if I'm gonna be honest about it. Can you stop? Just, uh, finish the rest of that, please. Thank you. Well, thank you. Well, thank you. And this is gonna kick up the next level of whatever. Right? Operation Sandstorm. Look who it be, the sad organ sack. Come for me now, have ye? Have, have ye? Will the Dread Pirate Robot be waiting for ye with a surprise or two under me belt? I, so I be. Oh my god. I can't even. New mission plans to the Autonauts HQ are pinned for your convenience. Apiary. Are these mines also explosive trap? Move sensitive and what was that? More sensitive and damaging than pitfall traps. Okay, now I need a trap cleaner upper or whatever. No more can we fart around by throwing bots at it, probably. Grass, okay. Okay. That smarted quite a bit. I took 22 damage with my 70% damage reduction. Okay. Ah, oh, damn it. I literally ran into that. Quite literally ran into that. Alright. Oh. Uh, that was fast. Alright, I keep forgetting how quick our recovery is. Um, all right. This doesn't look like super duper horrible. Oh, that's just a hole and not a murder trap? Okay. Uh, some of this doesn't look too terrible. Yeah, all in. Just all in. Thank you. Okay. That must be how I get power. Is this the Metalworks then? Of course it is. Uh, doesn't seem super terrible. One or two barracks, not too bad. I could do some pretty good work with the information I already have and the tools I already am equipped with. It doesn't seem too bad. It doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, it's never gonna happen. Okay. Uh, I was hoping to pull this over uh, one to the left, then this also one to the left, and see if I could do a little bit of work. See if I could get the new generation uh, harvest devices or processing devices going. That would be pretty cool. Damn it. Okay, so it's a one. It's a one-shot hit. Okay. Neat. <laughs> That's all. You just. 
just neat. That's all I have right now. Um, okay, a couple of options. Uh, I think I know what I'm going to do. Uh, you know what? Uh, how many do we have here now? 13. 13 is our maximum. Amazing. Uh, what do I have in our... thing? I think I want five more archers. Nope, that's... don't... wait. Are there two of you here? No, there's just the one. Okay, uh, you're sledgy. Uh, I don't think I have auto magic arrow make. So I make it myself. That's much more sane. Much more sane. Okay, I would like another 20. Okay, thanks. We're gonna do this the very, very lazy and very bad for everyone's health way. Uh, but it's easy, right? Did I mention? Did I mention easy? I think I did. In case I didn't, easy. Now, what would be really cool is if I, now that I see the coast, it would be cool to see how invasions are happening, so maybe I can curtail them. Maybe what I could do is I could feed I could feed the enemies through as if they were some sort of into some sort of labyrinth. Me. Uh well done lads. Well done lads. Okay. To me, thanks. Wow, those look threatening as hell. Did I get all my dudes already? Uh, I don't see my workers on the map. Oh, because they're non-military units, maybe? I, okay, it's fine. I did not understand the whatever. Okay. That all seems like fair have at, lads. Nope, don't pick them up. Uh, I don't have to be right on the thing, do I? Nope, right next to it is more than adequate. Okay, pretty easy fight. Everything else about this looks like it's a big suck sandwich, so we're not going to engage in such frivolous activity. I don't believe so. Not at this juncture or whatever. But if you all could come right about there. This seemed relatively safe, so I'm not worried about that all too much. Okay, well. Do it anyway. Cool, thanks. Now to test to see how potent these things really are. K 
Can I get all four with one shot? That'd be pretty cool. Nope. Does not seem as such luck. Okay, I want to clear out some of the area in between here and over there. So I can at least uh, proceed with some modicum of caution, and then I don't have to worry too, too much. Uh, that did get both of them. Nice. Okay, so maybe you just got to trigger them both right down the middle. Not quite. All right, well... Uh, apparently, disarming a trap is not necessarily an, uh, an exact science, even though it very well should be. Okay. That cleared out much of that. What I'm going to do with these fellows is, uh, nope. Full boat. I'm gonna send you back a little bit, so that way, depending on whatever direction they come from, this will be less of a concern. Uh, right there. Okay, that opened up this side pretty darn completely. Oh, look at that. Okay, do they, they just appear? They just appear or whatever, so... Huh. I don't know if that makes my plan more or less viable. Uh, what are you attacking? Tower attack. Okay, that tells me maybe... Some of Finn like a dis. Yeah, we got plenty of time. Okay, back to this. Uh, I don't really see... Many other points from this side. So we're gonna move right over here. Oh, I got two of them that time, nice. Go on, dust those fools! Did I get my bots? Nope, here they are. Alright, hello, friend. For the good of the whatever, right? Clicking a little too fast. A little bit of micromanagement here, I kind of feel is going to save me a lot of heartache later. Just troop loss and all kinds of crap I don't want to deal with. Um, realistically, one of the answers this game might provide, which it does, is just make a lot more troops. Just aut just automate way more troops. You'll get there eventually. Just go ham about it. Uh, valid? I think that's a valid thought about it, but I'd rather not lose the troops to begin with. These guys are significantly easier to make. Boop. This doesn't take really a long time. And also, the the mines do not seem to be rebuilt. So this is another fact of the game I'm trying to use to my advantage that uh, the dangers that are present do not get reseeded over and over and over and over again. If there was a pirate bot that came out and put fresh landmines out, you better believe your bottom dollar. We would be doing this the right way with the uh, lawn rakes for disarming tools or whatever. But this is what, like five or six minutes of my time? Not, not a big deal. How there isn't a straight up mutiny, I'll never, I'll never know, but. You guys seem pretty cool with this whole thing I'm doing. And boop. Okay. That took care of all the workers I had. Uh, is it time for straight-up combat, maybe? 
We can move in and start tussling about. That's a thing we could do. Purge out all these three, maybe? Actually, it might be smarter is to come in from this angle, eradicate this, and then work our way over? Uh, realistically, I would like to just get some work done. So if all y'all could hang out right about there, that would be grand. That would be le grand. How many troops are here? Eight? Okay. Uh, I would like to come back to base. I think I'll have enough time. Nope. Yep. I'm gonna come back to base. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to base. I'm gonna say, make me two more troops. And then I want ten more knights or whatever. And then... That'll take care of that pretty easy. Oh, that's something I wanted to do as well. Uh, I want to... I want to teach one of y'all how to change the thing. So, listen close. You're going to engage bear move to barracks, engage, set up, put to grunt, disengage. Perfect. This is something I should have done ages ago. This isn't what needs to get looped. This is. So I want two of these. Uh, so stop. I'm going to change it to literally anything else. Boom, baby. That's how that's got to work. Yep, that's gorgeous. So now I don't have to run all the way back down here to do bra ba da bra. Engaging with an object isn't scary if you define the darn thing correctly the first time. Um, what I had an issue with in the first game was I think I was doing all right with engage object, disengage object, blah 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 blah, but it didn't. I didn't think it was working out super great. I think I did stuff in the wrong order. I don't know. Okay. Engage to this. Oh, I should have done this ages ago. Blah, 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 blah. I want ten. Have fun. Okay, let's get some battlements going, shall we? See if we can keep this out of range. Eh, it's not gonna be easy. They'll come to us? Question mark? Oh, archers, no. Oh, sweet. Sweet baby child, no. Oh god, you're attacking all the way up there. Oh, the knights are doing it right. Okay, well... That was about as much fun as could possibly be had. How much armor do these brutes even have? 2,000? They seem to be getting iced pretty freaking fast. Right, because they're long range, they're not going to engage to us. We need to engage to them. Which is fine. I was just really hoping I could avoid the whole power nonsense. Okay, that's one cleared on the easy. Oh, no. This one's cleared. Still working on it? Okay. I didn't think it was going to be instantaneous. That second one cleared. Second, yep, there we go. Go, 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 go. Just run it. Just run it all the way. Looks like I only lost the seven archers. That doesn't seem too terrible. Oh. Uh, I should check you guys are not being chased. Just keep running. Because what's going to eventually happen... Okay, you know what? Yeah, okay, good. Yeah, you better run. Uh, what was eventually going to happen is that guy was going to run all the way back home and be like, Oh no, those guys are picking on me. And then my troops would chase, and it would just be a big, dumb, dumb, big mess. Okay, come here. 
knights. Uh, I want... Some of this math doesn't math. I want five? How many dudes are right here? Nine. Nine and eighteen, or ten and eighteen, does not forty make. I feel like I have a bunch of troops sitting somewhere and I don't know where. No. No. That's eighteen. So that second number is correct. I don't know where this 40 is coming from. Because my very terrible math says 28. Gah, I have no idea. Are we not building any more stuff? We are. I just coded you badly. I never updated everyone from the construction yard after I've moved it, you know, three or four times. Team of five. Uh, I guess that makes sense. Go for it. So again, 23. I'm missing 17 dudes. And this pile is 5. Hmm. Pretty suspicious. 1, 2, 3. Oh, I know where they all are. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 8, anyway. 8 plus 4 is 12. There's 12. Plus... 12 plus 23 is 35? Still smells like I got five dudes somewhere, but whatever. Okay. Uh, for me... Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this. But this doesn't matter, let's say right there. I want to go and I want to snipe those three outposts. Um, I think I only needed, like, a hundred thousand pieces of eight in order to get the last tech, right? Something like that? I'll have to check when we get back. Anyway, uh, to the stomper goes the spoils. Ten thousand? Good lord. Nope, nope, don't. Yes. And I don't care if I get got. Actually, it would be beneficial if I got got. Go, 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 lad. Okay, good stuff. Thanks. Uh, neat. So that was 30,000 pieces of 8-bit. That was very simple to get started. Good bread, buttered bread. Those two things have opened up. Uh, do I have new construction thingies? Probably a bunch of crap that gets upgraded into other crap, right? That sounds like a thing that would work. That would that would do. So if I wanted to build a bigger project to try to filter all of the raids, I would probably come about here-ish and just wall it off. And then hopefully they spill in a certain direction that would make defending a little easier. Uh, maybe wholesale more expensive, but I think that'd still be kind of fun. Um, Alright, I need to go fart about and find more places to smash. To smash. Uh, we could smash that. We're gonna wait until we get... Oh, uh, I could use more... Loyal... Dedicated... Supportive, uh, bot boys. I have to stop moving, of course. There we go. Okay, where am I?
Uh, let's come right about here. Oh, look at that. Bot assembly imminent. All right. Uh, nope. Okay, that was close. Many of these bases don't seem very complex still. Uh, maybe one defensive structure, if any. That makes it very good for me to just rush with knights. And just call it a day, really. And cover as much of this crap as possible. So this is the last territory zone. Which is really good, because that means everything I see and do now is permanent. Like, I mean, there's not, like, even more stuff I've got to ramp up and prepare for. 187 damage. Holy crap. Uh, we definitely need to get into trebuchets and stuff. I need steel beams. Er, steel beams? Wood wooden beams. Keep going, my lad. Yeah, keep going. Yeah, that's exactly how that was going to go down. And they made it through! My golly! My golly, my gosh, guys, how did they make it through? Do you, do you detect the shock and awe in my voice? Oh my gosh. I really could use the more upgraded defenses now that I really genuinely think about it. We've been doing pretty darn well with just the regular, so I haven't really bothered too much about it. Uh, oh, we already have the knight engagement. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, I'll take I'll take five more. Thanks. I got the money for it. I'm I'm good. I'm good for it. Those troops are kind of on the way. Yep, now they're ki now they're beating on it. As I say, now they're kind of making a mess of things. Easy fix though: two repair kits. Get this thing cleaned right up. Just like that. All right, back in business. All right, now uh, I wanted to continue the crusade if at all possible. Yeah, I think there's a bunch of little bases around here we can just snipe off pretty quickly. Um, I would honestly really like it if we could topple that. Uh, 23 out of 25. Have fun. Uh, yep. Okay, where... I was doing something. Oh, yeah, with the bots. 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 Now, where did I put them? Where did I misplace two dozen bots or something? I don't think it was two do Ah, there we are. Yeah, I don't think it was two dozen, but it was a number greater than one. And that's all I know. Yeah, I'm gonna get here. We'll do a little bit of coordination. We'll do a little more clearing of the pitfalls and such.
Man, I keep forgetting how long it takes for troops to get to, from one side of the world to the other. Anyway, uh, that... I might be able to avoid the smaller ones, but I'd rather be a little bit more of a completionist when it comes to clearing out traps. Only because if I look at it quickly and I'm like, well, I guess... What the hell's happening? Why do I have a stick? Get rid of the stick. Yeah, fine. Yeah, have fun with whatever I told you to do. Um, I'd rather take a little time and completely clear out an area. If it makes sense, because I don't want to be like, man, there's only one mine here. What's the chance my troops are going to stand on it? Um, knowing me, a hundred percent. One zero, a zero. That's why I'm trying to be like, let's get all the mines instead of it being like, oh, just get the get get the big ones. Just get the big ones. Now, this is a little bit of micromanagement. Yes. However, I've played and beaten Dune 2. Micromanagement don't scare me. In some cases, it does. Like, there are some games where it's like, man, I am clicking, like, six more times than I should. But, yeah, this isn't too bad. Okay, two arms. We're gonna put this over here. I don't want to come from this direction. We're gonna get a little bit of flack. Okay, have fun. Okay, don't engage that. Yeah, come back over here, fight these fools. Thank you. Run. Oh, no! Okay, well, they're in range now, so now we're gonna fight them. Freaking boo, man. I didn't want none of that. I didn't want none of that. Damn it! Ugh! All right, you got you got me. I no one to be mad at except myself. You got me on that. Um, okay. You please no, not to me. I mean, that's exactly what I told you to do, but it's not what I wanted you to do. Okay, go do that. Hey, thanks. Uh, yeah, let's uh let's see if we can manage a little more clearing. So we've got one thing here. The other thing must be like right here or something. Because uh, there's three things, right? Apiary, Jam Factory, Metalworks, and then the Fortress. I would like to get into catapults or trebuchets or whatever we have at our disposal instead of bringing in... Uh, sledge. Sledgy guys. I'm sure the the real trade-off is sledge sledge wielders are probably significantly more accurate and proficient in dealing damage, whereas a trebuchet is just like, you know what? Huck that thing somewhere downwind. We'll figure it out tomorrow. Kind of a thing. So you might need several catapults or several trebuchets to get the job done. Maybe it's something like that. If I had to guess, that would be my guess. All right. Stone deposits, which I don't really need. Yeah, the objective really is just to uncover everything. 
And there's the fort. Dang it, that was a lot faster than I was hoping it was going to be. Um, anyway, that gives me some good and clear indication of what I can mess with. This can get cleared very quickly. We have a... I was going to say, we got a really good path getting over there. No, we do not. No, we do not. Yeah, everything else about this is pretty stupidly treacherous as well. Uh, yeah, I feel like doing it this way. I don't know why. Okay, run me out there. Now, what happens is when a trap is triggered, it affects multiple entities. That's bad. I mean, it's good for the mine. Like, it's doing, you know, good damage, pulling its weight, whatever. Um, the problem for us is, realistically, I need to spread out all of my people. I can't just put them in a pile, me walk to the other side of the mines, like this, uh, follow me. Like, if I did this, and I was like, oh yeah, follow me, come, come get me, guys, and I'd lose all of them. It would be... I can't even land on... Oh, because both of them triggered. Oh, okay. I was like, I can totally land on one of them. What are you on about? You get out of here. You get out of here, sir or madam. Frickin... Frickin' landmines, you know? I'm saying it. Frickin' landmines. Okay. Um, I think we're not gonna do any more attacking. Not this episode, anyway. But if you could... Vominos in that direction. That'd be pretty landmine-free. I was over here or something? Where was I? Ah, I wasn't even moving. Cool. Oh, uh, where did I put... Dang it, I was remembering it based on the configuration of the landmines, and now I tripped them, and now I don't know where I put the... There they are. Man, you're so tiny. How are you so tiny? Alright, we're here. We're gonna do some more clearing out next episode, but I think this is a really good place to stop. Ooh. Uh, how far are we in, time-wise? Uh, 23.15? It's still gonna be really tight to get to 31 hours, or 30 hours in. Uh, would be cool, not critical, uh, but would be cool. Anyway, thank you all for joining me. Name's John Megacycle, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.